Today, we're diving into something absolutely wild. How artificial intelligence is about to transform two of the biggest jobs out there, doctors and teachers. Over the next 10 years, AI is going to shake things up, tackling the boring, data-heavy stuff, so expert care and education can be way more affordable and reach everyone. Big thinkers like Bill Gates are saying AI will be like a trusty co-pilot in hospitals and schools, as common as stethoscopes and whiteboards, boosting health and learning across the globe. But here's the real deal. This isn't about machines taking over. It's about teamwork. AI is going to supercharge what doctors and teachers do, but it'll also flip their roles in a big way. We've got opportunities, challenges, and a human spark no tech can touch. So buckle up and let's get into it. Let's start with medicine, because AI is already flexing some serious muscle here. Picture tools scanning x-rays or eye images and spotting cancers or eye diseases with pinpoint accuracy, sometimes even outsmarting top specialists. A few years back, researchers showed AI could diagnose skin cancer from photos just as well as expert dermatologists. It's not just about finding problems. AI is helping plan treatments, guessing how patients might fare, and digging through messy digital health records to make doctors' days smoother with fancy language processing tricks. Hospitals are jumping on this. In India, one major chain uses AI to sort patients, figuring out who needs help pronto using smart predictions. In the UK, chatbots are checking symptoms to cut down on unnecessary doctor visits. These aren't replacements. They're like turbocharged assistants, taking on grunt work so doctors can actually talk to patients. The dream? Making top-tier diagnostics dirt cheap, especially for places that rarely see a doctor. So what's the vibe by 2035? Imagine doctors with AI sidekicks as standard issue. You walk into a clinic and your doc's got a system that, in seconds, checks your symptoms, your history, and tons of global health data, then lists possible diagnoses like a pro. These setups, powered by next-level machine learning, are already being tested, brainstorming answers for super tough cases. By 2030, experts think AI could handle a third of medical tasks. Paperwork, routine tests, you name it. That frees doctors to tackle the hard stuff, counsel patients, or make big calls on what's right or wrong. Some tech gurus even say doctors might turn into health coaches, guiding us through all that AI brain power. But don't get it twisted. AI's got limits. It's a wizard at spotting patterns. But it stumbles when things get messy, like cultural quirks or super rare diseases you don't find in big data sets. Studies have shown AI kills it on textbook quizzes, but can choke in real life situations where gut instinct matters. That's why humans stay in charge. And let's talk about the big one, empathy. Say AI nails a diagnosis. Would you want a robot telling you you've got cancer? Heck no. A top heart doctor once said, even if AI is perfect, you need a human to break the news with kindness and care. Patients want trust, that real connection, no codes cracking that. Then there's ethics, deciding whether to fight a disease hard or focus on living well. That's deep human stuff, full of heart and soul. AI can't touch. So, doctors aren't fading out. They're leveling up, leaning on AI smarts to shine at communication, standing up for patients and making those tough calls. Now, let's swing over to education. Because AI is rewriting the classroom rules too. Apps like language trainers or online academies are tailoring lessons to each kid, tweaking the challenge as they go. Just last year, a major tech platform showed it could build lesson plans that keep students hooked on math and reading as well as any teacher. AI tutors are stepping up, giving instant tips like a personal coach, almost as good as one-on-one -on -one time. This stuff scales big. In China, one AI system is helping millions of kids, boosting test scores by double digits compared to old school classes. In the US, a university uses AI to spot students who might drop out, upping their stay-in-school rate by a solid chunk. Grading, tracking who's getting it, picking the right videos, AI's got that locked. Letting teachers focus on being that mentor who lights a fire under kids. By 2035, 
AI could be as normal in schools as whiteboards. Picture a teacher running a class where AI hands out custom exercises for every student on the fly, while the teacher sparks debates or helps someone who's stuck. Trials in the UK already show platforms cutting teachers' busy work by a fifth, suggesting exactly what each kid needs. This could change the game globally, bringing killer lessons to far-off places. The vision? Expert teaching for pennies, closing gaps so every kid gets a shot. Teachers won't be droning on in front. They'll be like directors, crafting AI-powered lessons, using data to catch who's falling behind, and pushing kids to think big. AI can mark essays or crunch math, but can it make a kid fall in love with learning or sort out the mess of history's big questions? Not a chance. There's a warning out there. Lean too hard on AI and school could feel like a soulless app. That's why teachers got to keep that heart-to-heart -heart vibe strong. And let's be real, great teachers are magic. AI can dump facts, but only a human can get a kid stoked about a subject or lift them up after a fail. Then there's the tough stuff. Handling a bully or teaching hot topics like politics? That takes human finesse, not circuits. Teachers are going to double down on creativity, emotional smarts, and real-world skills, places where AI is just a clunky robot. One education guru put it best, AI can feed you content, but only a person can help you figure out what life's all about. Now, this AI wave isn't all smooth sailing. We've got some hurdles. First up, retraining. Med students need to get cozy with AI diagnostics and number crunching. With schools shifting to teach coding and ethics, most medical programs are starting this, but the hands-on part's still rough. Teachers need a boost too. Think certifications that mix classroom know-how with tech chops, like some slick programs overseas. If we don't pour money into training, folks could get left in the dust. And that's trouble. Then there's keeping things fair and safe. In medicine, bad AI data can mess up diagnoses for some groups. We've seen it with early health models. Regulators are sketching out rules, but the world's playing catch-up. In schools, AI slurping up student info could lead to hacks or shady misuse. We need crystal clear rules to keep everyone feeling secure. And here's a big one, making sure AI helps everyone. Right now, rich hospitals and fancy schools are snagging AI first, which could screw over poorer areas with crap internet and no cash. There are pushes to get AI health tools to those places, but funding's a wall. If we don't spread the love, AI is just going to make the haves and have-nots gap even uglier. But here's the exciting part for anyone eyeing these careers. This isn't about jobs vanishing. It's about jobs getting better. Future doctors, think of AI as your trusty diagnostic buddy, letting you nail patient chats and wrestle with the big moral stuff. Aspiring teachers, see AI as your lesson customizing pal freeing you to spark imagination and build real bonds. If you roll with AI, your work's not shrinking. It's growing, sharper, hitting harder. The goal's epic, healthcare and education that reaches more people, works better, with AI crunching the boring bits so humans can pour their hearts into what matters. So, what's next? The coming decades about nailing the balance between AI and us in medicine and education. AI is taking diagnostics, grading, all that number stuff, no doubt. But the core of these gigs, that's empathy, inspiration, the guts to make hard calls. No bots stealing that. We've got to retrain smart, regulate right, and make sure AI is a win for everybody, not just the big shots. If you're dreaming of these fields, don't sweat it. Jump in and shape this future. Mix AI's brains with your human fire, and you'll help craft a world where healthcare saves more lives and education lifts every mind. The dream, expert help for all, super cheap, is so close, but only if we keep humans and tech as teammates, not enemies.